probably not going to feature it. A pedal from Matt of Goliath Studios. So check this out right here. This is an overdrive he made. And the cool thing about it, look at that. Ola 001, that's nice. Goliath FX. It's, it's a pretty simple overdrive, but the cool thing is obviously the comic book graphics. So it's comic book covered like this. And I think it looks really fucking cool. Look at that. So, finally, it took weeks to build, because I wanted it to be right, you know what I mean? There it is. There is the pedal that I made for all of England. Now, this is probably not going to feature it, but hey, you know. I am, I am really happy you know, with how it's come out. Um, so it's a, it's a simple transistor overdrive circuit. Um, I've put asymmetrical clipping in one position and LED clipping in the other position. Now the LEDs give it like a little bit more bassiness um, and then the asymmetrical ones are a little bit warmer and a bit more trebly. Um, that's what I hear. Uh, hopefully you will have hit, hear that through through the little demo as well. Um, it doesn't work great on its own into a clean amp. But it's not too bad, really. It's not the greatest of overdrives, if you know what I mean. But it, it to my ears, it really did push my Rocker 32 really well. It just gave it a load of balls, which I loved. Um, and I hope that's what he likes as well. I know he does like to use an overdrive. I couldn't make him a fuzz, obviously. He doesn't play fuzz. And uh, I'm no good at distortion circuits yet. You know, it's something I'm not tried. Um, I'm looking at trying. Um, we'll see. Uh, you know, but it, at JSA Effects has sent me a schematic for one of his pedals that keeps getting banned. Um, that well, because of his because of the name, the Fu. But you know, overdrive, simple overdrive into the rocker sounds epic. I just wish 
I had time to um, really set high gain up, a proper high gain amp up. I know he uses Sims as well, you know, amp Sims, um, and I've used it on like the Nolly Suite, and I, don't know, I think it sounded better on a real amp, but. I just hope he likes the look of it because I think it looks killer. So obviously we've got Miss Darth Vader, yeah. Um, I know he loves a bit of Star Wars. And Mr. Vader that side. Got the main Vader on that side. Yeah. Doing the choke, the boss joke. Um, and then the Emperor you know, chilling at the top the top tier top of the table with the top mounted jacks and obviously top power as well oversized enclosure because it's fun I love big pedals and I will not lie some other brothers do deny <laughs> do I have a look inside it because I did actually point to point wire this it's a bit messy but let's open it up so that's inside um, now that's called point to point wiring basically there's no board um, there's no Vero PCB it's all the components just soldered together and the reason why I did it like that was because I could not for the life of me get it to work on a Vero um, I sprayed a Vero to make it look all cool, you know, so it would have just sat in the middle there and then all the, the wires would have come off and been nice and stuff, but I could not get this circuit to work on a Vero board, it was doing my tree in. Um, so, yeah, I, uh, I decided to point to point it, um, and it might be a bit messy. It might be not the greatest. It's it's definitely not the best point to point work that's ever been done. But I did it and I impressed myself, to be fair. Thought, thought I did really well. Um, obviously there is a lot of room for improvement. I don't, don't think I could do that constantly as a, as a thing. I know there's a guy called Marcus who does point to point fuzz pedals. <sighs> Mate, I was stressed to high hell doing this. I don't know how you do it for a living. Um, but yeah, that's that's my pedal to Ola. Whether he features it or not, I'm not bothered. I just enjoy building it. I hope he likes it. And yeah. I hope you enjoyed this video um, if you've made it this far you stay to the end thank you very much I really do appreciate it um, only about 5% of viewers actually stay around till the end and if you're one of them you're part of the 5% club so thank you very much comment down below where you're from and um, that you're part of the 5% club and also let me know what you thought because I, I like I want to improve you know, um, so the only way I can improve is with feedback. So if you could let me know, that would be great. All right, that's me. Thank you very much for watching. Please subscribe if you haven't already and like the video. And stay tuned for more content. All right, thank you. Bye now.